I'm the chair of our subcommittee on work, work and welfare, and I have to tell you, I'm thrilled to look around this room today and see all the people that are here today to talk about TANF. Um, and last July, our subcommittee held a hearing investigating this same topic, TANF non-assistance and misuse of funds. And on that day, we had maybe 30 people in the room. So as I look around this room here today, this issue is finally getting the attention it deserves. And I want to thank the chairman for prioritizing it. Um, what we learned at our subcommittee hearing last year was that TANF non-assistance spending lacks basic financial safeguards that are included in most other federal programs, making it easy for states to divert funds and increasing the risk of waste, fraud, and abuse. Understanding what went wrong in Mississippi is important, but I hope people remember that this is an issue across the country. And what happened in that state is a symptom of the larger problem that requires congressional action to fix it. And I think it's also important to remember the title of today's hearing, Reforming TANF, States' Misuse of Welfare Dollars leaving, Leaves Poor Families Behind. And today is a culmination of two years' worth of work that we've done on our subcommittee on work and welfare. And we have a chart that's behind me here. And this chart um, provides a timeline and demonstrates the work that our committee has done on TANF. And I want to go through this uh, just, to, to just to show what led up to the hearing today. In March 2023, our Subcommittee on Work and Welfare held our first hearing examining work requirements in TANF and the need for reforms to strengthen basic assistance. As a result of that hearing, in May of 2023, we passed the Fiscal Responsibility Act, which included reforms to strengthen TANF and close loopholes to reinforce work requirements. In June 2023, we turned our attention to the non-assistance side of TANF and sent a letter to HHS requesting information on the agency's oversight efforts. In July of 2023, we held our second hearing on TANF. This hearing is a welfare check. What does your job mean to you and your family? It means everything because if you're homeless, I give you $100. You spend that $100, you're still homeless. If I don't teach you how to make money and benefit yourself and feed your family and support your family, we're purging money to people that don't care about bettering themselves, in my opinion. If you don't teach somebody how to make money and how to get a job and keep a job and support their family, uh, what are we giving them money for? Thank you, sir. I yield back, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Davis.